Hello there, welcome back. This is the first video in a series that I'm going to do about little bushcraft stroke survival tricks and tips. And this one is a one that I really love and I've never seen used before. So check this out. Okay, tip of the day is to use this space in your rolly mat. You may or may not be able to see, there's actually something in there. And when I went on an expedition recently, I had a small rod, which is a six piece, seven foot fly rod, in a rod tube inside of here. I since changed that, and now I've actually got just a piece of two inch diameter pipe that I can slot that into. It's not gonna fall out because it's a nice tight fit, and the beauty of this system is, this pipe can be used for something very interesting. This space is no longer wasted. And inside the rolly mat is my pipe. Now you might be thinking, I cannot see what the hell he's gonna do with that bit of pipe. But this is one of the most important things in my trapping arsenal. And it's for fish. Fish love to hide somewhere where it's dark and secure. If you can find a stream or a small river where there's fish and you can get in and remove as many of their natural hiding places as possible, sit this near the bottom or on the bottom against the side, put some flat stones over the top and leave it. Leave it for a day, two days or even just later in the day. It only takes the fish a few hours to find this and realize that it's a great place to hide. Point it upstream. You could even put rocks here to channel food in and fish are generally pretty lazy. They like to be where the food is coming to them. So if you can angle rocks like that out on the riverbed or stream bed, angle rocks like that, going away from it downstream, fish will find it, they'll hide in here the food will be funneled to them in here and they'll quite happily use this as shelter and also a source of food. It's like a, a food station for fish where you don't have to go and gather any bait. Now under normal circumstances you're really only going to have a maximum of one fish in here. Although you might get crayfish, little lobster things in here. You might get two or three in during normal feeding times. Fish are generally quite nervous things. If they see a bird flying over, they'll scatter. If they see a shadow pass over the water, they'll scatter. They'll look for the hiding places. You've set up this beautiful hiding place for them. So all you do after setting this up is come back late in the day or the next morning. Once the fish know that this is here, get some branches, thrash them on top of the water. The fish will panic and you've removed most of their hiding places, apart from this one. They're going to come in from downstream Fill up this pipe, you reach in, one hand over here, one hand over here, and you lift them out. It's that simple. And that is the secret of the pipe. There you go. Can't see through that rolly mat there. And who'd have thought there'd be something so important hiding in there where there'd normally just be free space. Hope you've enjoyed this tip. Check out my other videos. See you next time. Falling out of there.